a boat, a golf ball and a shield. It's not every museum that boasts such a varied and apparently disconnected array of items. But they all do have one thing in common. We've got items that tell the world story of leather from over 3,000 years ago right through to the present day. Um, some of the more fascinating things we've got, we've got rare fragments of the Dead Sea Scrolls. We've got a, a 2015 Jaguar F-type steering wheel in the finest stitched leather. So we have this wide range of items, all made of this one material, leather, that's been around since the dawn of time. Mostly recovered from a collection at Delapre Abbey, all the artefacts have been made with the utmost of care. Skilled workers laboured over every detail, captured here at the peak of their craft. Even Samuel Pepys' wallet is here, or, for the more modern gentleman, a pair of shoes worn by the man himself, James Bond. And there's more in the back, too. There are all sorts of items here, everything made of leather, of course. You've got buckets, chests, saddles, chairs, some slightly more bizarre objects. And, of course, any Northamptonshire museum wouldn't be fully complete without some kind of shoe. It's cost £180,000 to get to this point, a shoestring for a collection of this size. For those volunteering here, it's a vital part of this region's heritage. There's such an important part of life in Northampton and its history, and the museum is really bringing that alive for people. So giving people the chance to actually handle leather, hit bits of leather, um, is much more interesting than just things in dusty cases. I've never realised how many things um, are made of leather and how versatile a material it really is. I, people don't fully understand leather. They think it's just a, a pair of shoes walking around, but there's so many other things it can, can be used for. Now, these items that have been preserved for generations have found another home for at least a few years more. Graham Stothard, ITV News in Northampton.